What's going on now, Rocket Jabot, Director KG, and if you're watching and you're not tuning to KG Gaming, we are in episode 2 of The Devil In Me. Things are starting to get a little bit spicy. They left us on the island, so we're about to see what's going to happen next. No more chit-chat, let's get straight into it. Well, I'm looking. Oh, Kate wanted you to have this. Breaking down walls... Navigating the maze of anxiety. Are you fucking kidding me? I think she thought it might help with your stress. Or... Absolutely not. I'm not stressed. Okay. You sure? Because you look Do I like look it. Fucking stressed. Indeed. Uh. That was rhetorical. Well, your cards came out nice enough. Oh yeah, embossing makes a huge difference. You old guys love business cards. <laughs> old school. You old school guys. I also put it on heavy Charlie stock. Charlie can use business cards to open locked drawers. Damn. That's good to know. I should have had one ready for Mr. Dumas. Did you find them? I... No. I swear I put them in here. I don't understand. <sighs> Jesus. Look, stop tearing around in there like a maniac. Be organized about it. Methodical. That blue bag, front pocket. I made a specific mental note of it. They're gone, Charlie. Gone? I wonder Just if the like relationship thing went up or down with that choice. Took them? I, I don't... Actually, I can see Kate doing that. Or Jamie. I'm sorry. He Technically, I feel like he would go frustrated, but then he's kind of like bipolar with it, so... It's fine. Let's just get on with things. I'm going to try to go with making this a decision each massive. time Surely and not there going is a pack of cigarettes in here nothing. somewhere. Even if they're ancient. You need them that bad? There was a bar off the lobby. There must be cigarettes in the bar, right? I mean, oh, technically, it's okay. not legal to smoke in bars, so... Come on, we're checking. If you find them first, all will be forgiven. I have a lighter. But now I know that I can open drawers... I guess I have to find a locked one first. Why he sound like he out of breath already? Jeez, examine. The yellow cross. Uh, don't care for it. Not gonna lie. Okay, how do you jog again? Okay, got it. Got it. This is locked. The scope of this place is. I can't believe locked. you've locked into this. Okay, are I guess I gotta go that way since she's going that way. Those look cheap. But they are cheap. Can't be helped. This will be the one that people locked. remember. The one that wins an Emmy? Exactly. Locked. That's the spirit. Locked. Stick with me, Erin. I didn't even peep this right here. Is that the book I threw? Examine. Yeah, it is. Let me worry about that. You stick Breaking to making sure that my life runs smoothly, and I'll make sure you keep working. Sound good? Uh, sure. I hope we get another season. That's how we get our bread. Okay, what's over her? Aha. Nothing. Hmm. Okay. Tell me when I can open lock dressers. Is that an opal? It's an opal. Give me that. I have eight of them and I still can't spend any. Oh, nine now. This place is like a maze, bruh.
Did she already go downstairs? Oh, she's on that side. Lock. Gotta check, gotta check, check. You see? That's why you have to check. Check your mirror's breath. Good evening, thank you for allowing me to talk, contact you directly. Your publisher said that you were very keen with her. Uh, Inglewood, uh, Chicago. Interesting. First of all, don't creep up on me like that again. Secondly, let's go down these stairs. Hey, oh. Charlie. What's this? I was hoping next season maybe I could do more with the sound design. 178. Erin, what you already do for this company is very valuable to us. What is 178? Carrying your bags and picking up your laundry. Absolutely. To get ahead in this industry, you have to pay your dues. Show you're ready to muck in. Locked. I... I think you should get an assistant. An assistant? Oh, it was okay. just a stupid idea, Charlie. I'm an just... Assistant. Okay, we gotta go that way. A personal assistant? Sort of. And then I could help out with the editing. Pardon me? The editing? I suppose I should be thankful it's just my cigarettes that are missing and not our gear. Oh, this the is the gearboxes. Okay. Look, I just think you've got so much to give, so much experience. And it's an opportunity to pass that knowledge on. Right. Yes, I suppose it is. And an assistant wouldn't lose my cigarettes, would they? Exactly. Yo, he's mad salty about that. So, do you still want to direct movies, Charlie? I am directing. No, but I mean real movies. With a big budget and big stars. Wait, so... Erin, there's something important that you have to understand. In the work that we do, the very important work, the Hold truth on. is the star. Oh, right. 29 yeah, to sorry, the fourth. So you don't want to direct movies. So they were... Can we move what? on from this? 31... One, two, three, four. About six days. Second crew. Couple of more days. I'm trying to see if there's any, like, correlation. Oh, wow. They literally came in right after. First crew left the fourth. Next crew came in the fifth. And then the 18th. 19th the next crew came in to the 20th and then we're the next oh my so we're about to last about six days and then something's about to happen interesting um okay so this is the bar right no which double oh we gotta go through those double doors Locked and locked. Okay. Oh, can I go back here? Yes, I can. Can I use my card? Oh, yeah. this uh, Mr. Monday Thank you for choosing Twilight P Prairie as residence for your mother. Oh. Interesting. Okay, so there's that. Nothing else? No. Alright, let's go. I already turned that on. Hey, maybe Mr. Dumet is in the back office. You could just ask him about cigarettes. Or maybe he left the island. 
gotta go through there. This is locked. Check your mirrors, Brev. Check your mirrors. Can I pull this off? No. Okay, come on. Using keys. Investigate the noise. Who's ringing that bell? Do I have keys? I don't think I have a key. We examined this already. So somebody just Jack left the key for us? Erin, I found the key. Now we're being watched. What are the odds? He runs funny. Open says me. Why don't I go check for a gift shop or something? I've already had one asthma attack today, and this dust farm is exactly what I don't need. A gift shop might have cigarettes. Exactly. Had a girl. Yo, he's fiending. Hello. Here. Mr. Dumet. Nothing here. Hello. I thought I saw a little sparkle. Check your mirrors. What we got here? This looks very old. Good morning to you all. I'm Chester Bell, Assistant Director at the Federal Bureau of Investigation. At approximately 0530 local time, a team led by Special Agent Hector Monday and supported by law enforcement officers conducted a raid of a motel room just outside Birmingham, Alabama to apprehend Manny Sherman, the man known as the Beast of Arkansas. Using state-of-the-art psychological profiling techniques, Special Agent Monday and members of his task force not only identified their suspect, but predicted his movement with unerring accuracy. I'm delighted to say we have our man. They got him. But golly, that doesn't explain why there's still madness happening. Anything? No. I don't want to click anything on the actual bar yet. We have a glass. We have that. Look, we got something else right here. I would like to thank you for the incredible work you and your team achieved at the hotel. I would like to extend my heartfelt condolences. The accident that befell the skeleton skeleton crew. I invite yourself and the rest of the team to join me for the grand opening ceremony at 7 p.m. Interesting. So they have some type of ceremony. Cigarettes. Okay. Nothing. Was he always there? Was he there the whole time? I'm bugging. Wow. An animatronic. Ha! Huh. That's what amazing. What would be, Mr. Demet, sir? <laughs> I'll have a packet of cigarettes, please. A packet of cigarettes, please. Hello? Hello? A packet of smokes. I can get some on the thing over there. The Never mind. Thank you, Robo Bowman. Certainly, sir. Whenever you wish. <laughs> no fucking way. 
Thank you very much, my mechanical friend. Special feature unlocked. What? What feature? I still need change. Yes. <laughs> yes. How am I supposed to get it? Oh, of course, it wants exact change. Damn it. Prairie. Now you about to take change from the cash register. Wow. Any change in here seems to be locked. But I have my card. Got it. Ah. Oh. Next round's on me. Promise. Wait, did you... Did you even take the change? Yes. Dr. Daddy. Get stuck. Oi. Oi. Oh, no, 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 please. Come on, no. I don't know what I was supposed to, like, hit. I'm assuming that. What? No. No, please. I'm having a really shit day. And you've just made it worse. Hmm. So I'm supposed to find a way to open the dispenser. Okay, go through there. Oh wait, oh no. Oh yes. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Come on, you piece of shit. Don't do this to me. <sighs> Antique rubbish. Give them to me. Give me my cigarettes. Right, you. That's it. I'm going to go and get my key grip, and they are going to kick the shit out of you. Hey, Charlie. Yeah. I'm still in the bar. I think it's dinner time. We should get everyone else. Okay, I'm coming. And I'm coming back for you with a fucking pry bar. Are you alone in there? Who's that behind the bar? What? Bruh. Right, so now hey. we'll mark. Had a thought on an intro segment. You want to shoot now? Yeah. If we get it shot and in the bank, maybe Charlie will stop rewriting everything I come up with. Yeah. <laughs> okay, sure. He's so what? like uptight. Nothing. Just give me a sec and I'll be good to go. I'm supposed to buy nothing is eating away at you? Yes. How Scott. many times have you cleaned that lens? I'm just prepping my gear. Really? Yeah. Always focusing on the detail, Mark. What about taking a huge risk and just do something? Like what? I watched you fuss for a whole week before you turned down that job offer, all because you had to take one extra train to get there. Mm, cynical. I turned down that job because that would have left you alone with Charlie. How cruel do you think I am? I'm being serious. So am I. Fine. I'll drop it. Great. Let me grab the camera. Let's use natural light so we can do it alone. Didn't the lobby have skylight? I don't remember. 
I just want to look decent. Reassuring. You look good in any light. I'm not worried. Are you trying to butter me up? Yes. Is it working? Marginally. <laughs> I'll take it. Ark, why are you letting them all think I broke up with you? I feel like if Jamie knew the truth, she might back off. I mean, they all just assumed. I can't decide if that's sweet or selfish. Or both. So they were a thing. We're hitting the golden hour. We should be able to find a good spot. <laughs> I don't know why you camera dorks call it that. It's 15 minutes at best. Yes and no. If you have the right reflector. 15 minutes at the most. <laughs> Look, let's go find some light and get started. Thanks for doing this. You're only asking me because your arms are too short for a good selfie angle. My arms are not short. <laughs> All right, I gotta go back in the room. Hold up. Where to? Uh, the balcony would make for a cool angle. Let's find a way up there. Aha. How's the new place? It'll do for now. You like it? It's just a place to keep my shit in crash. Short term lease, so I can take my time to find something I really like. Let's I can use the camera to find. Mm. Opportunities. You said I needed to be out, so I got out. I was complimenting you. Yeah, just saying. You're always just saying. I was saying. worried you'd be sleeping on the couch in the studio while you obsessed over finding the perfect place with the right wall color near the proper train station or bus stop. Or Maybe we should just add this topic to our discussion no-fly zone list. Yeah, you're probably right. Okay, we have stairs, and we also have. So, since room. we can't do it tomorrow, is next weekend okay to come and get my stuff? Whoa, there, Bucko. I was just checking for a light. Remember our talk about boundaries? I need my room to be my private, safe place. Interesting. Sometimes I'm glad we went to therapy. Other times, it makes for some weird-ass rules. But didn't she come into my room? That is so not fair. Alright, what we got, what we got, what we got? Whoa. There's something back here. That's interesting. Nothing here. So if Dumet catches us in here, are we breaking one of his rules? He did say not to go wandering. And we did practically bust the door down and get in here. We? So maybe we should take care. Probably. See a cart. Huh. Guess we're not totally alone. We got home. Yeah, I feel like Dumet is the kind of dude who loses his shit if you break his rules. Oh. What was your first clue when he took away our phones like we were kind of teenagers? All right. Shit. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of me. What we got here? Okay. I think we have another one on the other side. Like a giant this slash. takes me back. I used to carve the hell out of my desk in middle school. Rebel. <laughs> okay. Nothing else to see here. His monopod to reach. How bad would it have been if I just let it drop? It couldn't have been that uh, serious. Births, deaths, and marriages. Whoa. Alright. Let's 
keep going. Okay, let me move. Move. Oh my. What's over here? There's gotta be a way through. Okay, so the balcony, that's the balcony that we were trying to look for. It's currently Look locked. at this wallpaper. Can we go through here? There. See that key? We need that key. Just need to find a way through. Okay. So we're going to have to go up and over. Oh, this is this? old as hell. Everything here is old as... Manny Sherman... Born January 1, 1956. Come on. You know all this. What do you want? What's this? Huh. You've been doing your research, haven't you, Special Agent Monday? What are my favorite television programs? Describe my first pet? What were your friends like as a child? What is this? You're taking a survey, you're trying to learn something. Would it kill you to be direct? You wanted to know what inspired me? As if I wasn't an original? Well, maybe there was one man I found myself a little fascinated by. Henry Howard Holmes. Why? Because he was numero uno. America's first. The guy invented the trade. He set the benchmark, you know? Learn your history, Monday. Read a book. You think because I stuck a blade in some people and get off on it, I'm not smart? He's wicked. I, uh, allegedly killed 13 people before you got smart enough to find me. 13 is wicked. Looks Some like Dumet is trying to preserve things. Can't be easy all the way out here. I like antiques as much as the next person, but at some point you have to give up the ghost. Just gonna have to climb up there. Rod is gonna set it. So we're not gonna acknowledge right. the fact that they just That's heard it. that. What? But since we got here, I've been smelling something faint, distant. Can't place it. It's decay. Old house. Island beaches with dead fish, animals in the wood. Could be anything. Whatever it is, it's dead as hell. Okay, we gotta go around. Why are they all breathing so hard, bro? <laughs> Push. Perfect fit. <coughs> we got a lot of. How do I? Oh. Keep your head down. out the window okay let's bring this ladder down am I supposed to climb
climb back up. Then we have to jump across. I thought it was gonna make me use the monopod and like bump it down. Yeet. Yeet. This should work. Mark? You okay in there? I'll be right yeah. back. Now I gotta put that back. This is a low key a lot. Grab this. Back where it was. Let me climb this. Mm -hmm. What's this on the left? Nothing. Climb through. Nothing there. Like slide down the ladders, or something. Nothing here. Can I open this? Nope, that's locked. <laughs> Climb over. You can do this. Uh huh. Uh huh. Nothing else here. No paperwork. Just keys. Give me that. If I would have had to do all that just to get out, uh, bruh, that would have been mad annoying. And now, to the balcony! Insert key here. Hi. My vertigo is saying otherwise. Then don't look down, stupid. What are you worried about, Miss? Always be camera ready. Mm-hmm. You look amazing as usual. Mm-hmm. Alright, which way? We came from this way, right? Yeah, we came this way. We let him out. Possessions belonging to the victims of... What? It's giving... Museum. Hey, check this out. It's his hat. Who? H. H. Holmes. Nah, that's wicked. Fuck! You okay? No! Fuck! You okay? No! I just... <laughs> this fucking thing popped out of nowhere. I wasn't expecting that. Ah, he wasn't gonna get me twice. See? Well, what is it? Some kind of animatronic? Yeah, a fucked up looking one. <sighs> it can't hurt you. It scared you. It scared you twice. <laughs> hey, Charlie, it's eight. Dinner time. Damn it. We didn't get anything. There's still time. Come on. Let's not keep Charlie waiting or we'll never hear the end of it. I'd still do it. Hey, if I didn't have Charlie. to go through a whole puzzle, we would have had time. Civil blowing up on me when all I did was my job. I'm the one doing the talking on camera, not him. Come on, you came in hot on him, and you know it. Not that you're wrong, but you know he meets anger with more anger. 
This is on him, Mark, not me. I know Charlie can be a pain in the ass. Did you see his notes? Yeah, I saw them. I can't say half the shit he writes. It may look good on the page, but there's more to it. I'm trying to help, and he throws it back in my face. Because you... Because he thinks you're just trying to get content for your showreel. What if I was? Ooh. Charlie does seem to think he owns us. Mm -hmm. He's so damn controlling. I don't let him control me. Why else do you think we fight so much? Did you know Aaron hasn't been paid in weeks? He told her that learning from him was its own reward. Piece of Working for shit. free is crazy. Unless it's an He's internship. He's running around town, picking up his laundry, doing his shopping like he can't do anything for himself. Doesn't matter. One way or another, I am moving on from Lana at Entertainment. I ain't mad at it. Do you, boo? Good for you. That's that's definitely the right call for where your career is going. That sounded very sincere. Because it is. Charlie would replace us in a second if he wouldn't be inconveniencing himself. Exactly. He's using us. I deserve better than this. So do you. We all do. What a stunning performance. You should give up news and be an actress. I was quite moved by all that. Fucking Oscar worthy. You don't know what we were talking about. I heard enough, thank you. I know what betrayal sounds like. I'm particularly disappointed in you, Mark. Whatever your future plans may be, right now, you work for Lonnet Entertainment. And Lonnet Entertainment employees are meeting for dinner to speak with our host. Charlie, I didn't even I'm say sorry. anything. And Lonnet employees are professionals, yes? So start acting like it. Great. Happy? You have a future, and now I don't. That man is a goddamn child, and somehow we all sink to his level. I had a feeling he was listening because the, the camera angle. Who's controlling these animatronics, bruh? Is he making her? It looks like he's making her. Hey, guys. Think it's okay if we pour some wine? It's pretty <laughs> tense. Please do. Has anyone seen Mr. Dumet? Yeah, Can he did. For him? Just poor Mark. Let's all just relax. We just sat down, give the man a moment. He's the host. I haven't seen a soul here aside from the groundskeeper. He's probably cooking dinner himself. Probably. Uh, Mr. Dumet! I love what you've done with your hair. We started on the wine. Hope that's all right with Dumet? you. Dumet? Yeah, back to it ain't coming. Wait, what, why? You saw all the snide things you tweeted from his limo. I didn't. What are you talking about, Jamie? He got back aboard the ferry and left. What? When? Right after we got to our rooms. He just left. You yep. sure? Can't be. You must be mistaken. I'm not blind. I know what I saw. Why would he leave? That makes no sense. This is a movie if I didn't see one. They're in a big ass hurry. Guess you were right. There was some kid here. I saw them together when I was looking for my room. Another perfect Charles Lonnet plan comes together. What's our next step, boss? Swim for sure? Mm -hmm. Why would he invite us here and to dinner and then just leave? I'm sure he has his reasons. Who knows what could have cropped up? Maybe he ordered pizza for dinner and the dock is as far as they deliver. This could work to our advantage. How? Well, think about it. We're still here surrounded by perfect visuals. The plan is still on track. There has to be a yeah. legit reason he left. We shouldn't leap to conclusions. 
Guys, am I the only one who's getting really freaked out by this place? And by Mr. Dumet? As much as it pains me from the depths of my soul to say it, I'm starting to side with Jamie on this one. Thank you. Lower your voices. Why? He's not here. Literally. But that doesn't explain why he stitched out on us. He had to go back to establish an alibi. What are you... You know, so when our bodies wash up on the other side of the lake, he has plausible deniability. Mm. Oh, God, Shit. Jamie. Can you stop trying to make this worse? It's I her foreshadowing okay, everything. Okay, fine. Just don't come crying to me if you end up dead. What is wrong with you? I'm just saying. I mean, she's not I guess wrong. we never found your cigarettes. Incorrect. I found an extra special pack of invisible cigarettes. In fact, I'm smoking one right now. See? <laughs> that explains why you're in such a great mood. So what are we doing? Technically, I should be pissed just off, gonna but... just sit here and pretend to eat? What's the plan, Charlie? The plan? In true Lana Entertainment fashion, we're going to sit with our thumbs in our asses until a panic deadline looms over us and then we'll just throw some shit together and I'll save it with a voiceover. Well, here's to Topeka, no longer being the worst decision Charlie has ever made. <sighs> Enthusiastic, because we're having a grand time. Now, I would like to toast all of you really i know that i'm the butt of your jokes and that's just my cross he has anger issues but it's family. more like mark and bipolar Jamie, than actual like aggression because he's and always Kate, uptight but then despite he flips it to something nice you after are the heart of this show you keep people interested And finally, to our newest recruit, Erin, we would be lost without you. Who else could we trust to remember every little detail? You know, I yelled at you. Thank you all for your hard work. Cheers. Cheers. To us. Mazel tov. What we can get here can take the show to the next level. Sure, if we have time to get it all. Yeah, he totally heard us. Yeah, facts. Nah. No way he'd say all that nice shit if he heard us. Maybe we shouldn't talk about it right this second. You brought it up. <sighs> what was that, Kate? Nothing important, just spitballing some ideas. I think she'll look best if we can really make the backgrounds look as creepy as possible. Shouldn't be hard. Just pick a spot in the crib. Um, does anyone else think it's weird? Dumet hasn't showed up yet. Yeah, I don't think he's coming. Me neither. What do we want to do first, Charles? You're the boss. Thank you. I think it makes sense for us to start in the lobby. There's still decent light to work with, and it's symbolically where things would begin in the murder castle. With what light's already in there, we just need to set up a couple of our own. We can make it look as if it were lit by gaslight. Perfect. What if Dumet shows up? Mm. Authoritative. If he tells us to stop, I'm going to be having a strong word with him. He's put us in this position. All right, everyone grab what they need and we'll meet in the lobby. Let's be as professional as possible from here on in, please. No mistakes. Perfection. If he comes back, I don't want him to see us fucking about or arguing. Good call. We're on it. Right, guys? Fantastic. Yes. I'd love to hear that. Break. Shouldn't take me long at all. Great. Great. I feel like every time it shows this thing right here, it's like level complete. 
He's making animatronics of everybody. I'm convinced. Whoever this person, yup, the glasses and everything. Wait, I gotta check for opals. I'm hearing doors open and close. Hold up. This just changed. There's a button there. <laughs> yeah, I'm dead. This is why I die, right here. There was no way to, like, avoid that.
breakers. Okay, hold up. I gotta get the power on so homegirl don't die. Some things I can examine. We already checked this out, but not with her, so we'll look at it again. This is a script. Huh. Katie's getting creative with Charlie's script. We already saw this already. Okay. This is our equipment. Locked. Switch it back. Yeah, keep it like that. Or does it go back every time? I want to leave it on the up position. That seems to be the only like light setup we have as well. Okay. So now we could go up the stairs. It looks like. Should we go up the stairs? One eighty. What does... I don't know what that means. Why does everybody breathe so hard? Shit. Hello? Mr. Demet? Can I open this? this something about the lighthouse okay I can open that but before I do spa Okay. This is a code of some sort, zero four five one. Zero four five one. If I have like a safe or something, that's what I have to use. Zero four five one. Might be time to join the twenty first century, guys. Zero four one. Let's open this. Or not. Zero, four, five, one. It's not like there's a safe in here or anything. Zero, four, five, one. Zero Great. Five into the creepy maintenance room in the creepy hotel on the creepy island to shoot a doc about serial killers all alone and without my stun gun. Oh, without the stun gun is crazy. Oh, we choices, need that. Choices, Jamie. Zero Make four five better one. choices. This is your own damn fault. Online auction. Zero four five one. Yeah. 
Wait, was I'm confused. Zero four five one zero four five one into a tourist attraction. Almost a mill. To do renovations to make it a tourist attraction. Jeez. Zero four five one. Let there be like something from this century. Okay, uh whoops. Okay, this one. This one? Okay. This one. This one. Then we go here. 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 This one gives power to this one. Um, this goes to this, this goes to this, this goes to this, this goes to this. So maybe this one. This lights this, this lights this, this one lights this one. Got it. I lucked out on that one. I'm not gonna lie. Gucci. Attention. Attention. This is a severe weather storm warning for the Greater Lakes area. High winds and heavy rainfall What's are expected by 10 p.m. Central Time. Repeat. Here we go.
This is how I kill them by being nosy. I walk in here, the door's closed. I'm not. No, I'm not doing that. I'm going to the lobby just like uh, the directions told me. I'm going to follow directions today. Normally, I wouldn't. Today, I'm following directions. It looks like I have to go to the scary room. Yep, because it's not letting me go in the lobby. Oh, great. <sighs> Did I just go in a circle? Can't leave. I found an opal. Oh, and wait, no, that's the tape. God damn it. It did me the favor. I didn't even have to walk over here because that's exactly what I was going to do. Okay, let's see what this tape got. I had to build my own little castle, just like Holmes did. Most people like me do their business where their target lives. That's just asking to get caught. Holmes had the right idea. It's all about the honey trap. You bring me some smokes? Like I asked? Lucky Reds? Yes. Oh, these are like gold in here. Damn, that's good. So, yeah. The honeypot. Holmes built a hotel about a mile from the World's Fair and called it the World's Fair Hotel and bought ad space in papers alongside ads for the expo. Rubes from far and wide assumed it was the official hotel. Come on, Pa Kettle. Take a train in from Nebraska. Takes three days. They roll up into that joint ready to rest, get to their room, and whoops. What do you know? Holmes had a gas pipe hidden under the bed and poisons them. Maybe he pulls a trap door on them. Maybe he separates them and makes one watch through a window while he slits the other's throat. That's the advantage of a honeypot. No shortage of targets. <laughs> That's why I picked all those houses north of the airport. That whole neighborhood was scheduled for demolition, and yet... All those lovely realtor ladies must not have gotten the memo. Call up as a contractor. Tell them I'm flipping. Have them meet me out there. And look at that. We're the only two people for miles. 
The first couple times I wait for a plane to fly over just to hide their screams, but after a while I realized they could scream as loud as they wanted. No one was gonna hear a thing. That's what I remember most, those screams. You can try to understand why I am the way I am. You can forensic science up all the data you want, but you'll never know. You'll never know, Monday. You'll never really know how it feels when you watch the fire burn out of somebody. My man's is wicked. Wait, there was, there was a shimmer over here. Nosy. That's it. What was the point of that shimmer? Alright, let's get out of here. How are we looking, Jamie? Little electrical drama, but we're about good to go. This looks great. Very gaslight. Mm, if we had a grip with some foil, I could get a good flicker effect going. This would be fine. I just got a bit more to do once Kate's standing there. Should be more than a few minutes. Mm. Hey, thanks for that stuff you said at dinner. It was nice to hear. We're all on the same side. Sometimes we forget. What the hell? Don't die. Please don't die. Hey, hey, help! Somebody help me! I can't see a thing! I... Guys, guys, please! Aaron? Distressed? Asthma pump. Am I gonna have to like guide her or something? I don't know what's happening. It's okay. We're right here. You're not hurt, are you? Inhaler. I, I need my inhaler. Having an asthma attack. What's your room number? I. Hurry. Hurry. Where's the room? Next to mine. Down the long hallway to you. Aaron. I'm going. Try to breathe slow and easy. Do I have to do the button technique? We're here, Aaron. Just try to stay calm. Count your breath. One, two, three, in. One, two, three, out. We need to break through this thing. Guys, I... I, I can't. I need you to Don't relax. No. Who's there? <gasps> oh no. If she actually dies, I feel like this one was like inevitable because frightened. Get away from me. I'm frightened. Someone's in here. Yeah, I gotta let him know. I, I, guys. Guys, somebody is in here. With, with me. Oh, God. I gotta let her know, because... Well, I'm gonna try to defend myself. He's gonna smoke me. Attack, take. I'm gonna die anyway.
In and out. Yo, we did it. Hey. You're okay now. You're safe. What? Did you see him? Come on. <laughs> nah, that was wicked. Yeah. Holy he was, moly. Somebody was right there. In there with me. Eric. It's just a dummy. No. no, it was not a dummy. He he had a hat on, like H.H. H. Holmes. Charles, you're working her to death. Now she's hallucinating shit from the show? I did not. Nothing bad happened, Erin. You're okay. No one is in there. Let's all just calm down, get Erin back to her room for a rest. I'm not fucking tired. Let's go. Come on, Erin. What camera is that? We oh. finally see him again, bro. That's like a are. two and a half hour gameplay before Aaron seeing this guy. Signs of serious pluck, wouldn't you say? Now, where's our wayward host, Mr. Dumet? I don't know. Apparently, he did. He's left the island. How very rude not to stay for dinner. Charlie managed to rally the troops, though, and a good thing. The road ahead is full of challenges. Oh, brother. I can only observe, and it can be frustrating to watch. In some ways, I envy you. I only record events. You get to shape them. You'd better get back to things before one of our friends makes a poor choice on their own. right there we're gonna end it right there i prevented a death I'm not gonna lie i thought she was gone so that means if i would have attacked he would have hit me with the reversal yeah. and i would have been tight but we did it so if you guys are enjoying what you're seeing please subscribe to the channel don't miss an episode Smash that like button, comment your favorite emoji, it helps with the algorithm, and I'll see you in the next one.